So today we're gonna try a famous Malaysian breakfast that all of you have been telling me to try, Roti Chanai, but with a twist. Later on in the video, we're gonna try Roti Chanai Banjir, which I think translates to Roti Flood. If, is that right? But in order to fully appreciate that version, we first must try the traditional method. So what's your favorite kind? Cheese. Cheese? And normal. Normal? We are starting here in a very local restaurant before heading into Mansion Tea Stall in the heart of Kuala Lumpur. I've seen these kind of restaurants all over Kuala Lumpur and they're always packed with locals, so they must be great. Now roti or bread, both bread, but specifically roti is one of my favorite foods in the entire world but I haven't had it in Malaysia like this yet. So let's go check it out. Yeah. Oh, look! Yeah, <laughs> All right, I've been sent to get some tea tarik. Abakaba, uh, can we get some tea tarik? Uh, Goes up like this? Yes, yes please. Whoa! So it looks like there's so many different types of roti and they start down here. They start being clumped up from these little balls of bread spread out on this table, sort of opened up. I guess the feelings go inside at this point and they get flipped around like that to open them up, which is awesome. And then down here, they're getting pressed together and then he puts them onto that frying pan that where it cooks, I guess. And then he puts them over here. Ready to go out. Or they get chopped up on this board, which is awesome. This is so cool. Dorsa? Dos, dos, eh? Yeah. Ooh. Dosa, dosa. Dosa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or pr prata? Yeah. I love prata. Which one's your favorite? Do you like roti, banana? Roti banana, roti banana. milo, milo with the cheese. Oh, milo. Roti milk. Oh, yeah. Which one's this? Hot one. Hot one. Spicy? Hot, spicy. Oh, okay. And then fish? Fish curry. Uh, vegetarian. Vegetarian, perfect. Thank you. Okay, everyone is so friendly. They're like telling me all about roti and dosa and which one's which. And I love all of them, but we're gonna try this one for the video today. He also was like, go and get some tea. He like flings it up in the air and I was like, no way. And I went and I watched it and he was like pulling the tea. I think it's called pulling the tea. But the cool thing about that is, is it comes out with this like frothy top on top of the tea. It's like really like frothy. I don't know how else to describe it. Kind of like like the, the head or the top of a beer. Looks really cool. Let's try this. Oh, okay, that's good. Mm. I think I love iced tea. I'm usually an iced coffee girl, but this is delicious. Mm. The sweetness is a really good amount. It's not too much, it's not too little. I love this. I love that. I love the taste of that. That's delicious. But let's get into the roti. Okay, so we got two types of roti chana here. We have roti plain and we have the egg one as well. Now we have also three different types of curry. He was telling me what, what they were. All right, so I'm gonna try the maybe fish one, fish curry. Oh, that's amazing. Who knew bread could be so delicious? <laughs> oh man, that's good. It's so, it's so fluffy. It's so light and fluffy and like crispy on the outside. It's soft on the inside. It has a really nice taste to it. I'm not sure how to describe it, but this is the plain one. So then we're gonna try the vegetarian. So I'm gonna try the egg one. I got egg as well. So this is just the roti chanai with an egg um, cooked through on the inside as well. So this is a vibe in here, by the way. Everyone's so friendly. It's full of people. It must be the place to go. And it's really early at the moment. It's about eight o'clock in the morning, 8.30. Um, and this is a breakfast, but I know that everyone loves it so much. They, it can be eaten at almost any time of the day which is awesome it's good for me <laughs> I love egg and I love bread the two of them together is amazing wow you could have either you could have the plain I like both I might even like the plain a little bit more but I love egg so if you like egg you'll like this you'll like both that's what I'm trying to say I like both I don't can't pick can't pick <laughs> let's get stuck into it old one like, yeah. yeah, it's um almost like Australia. Australia. That's like a Australia. That's the same the sort same. of price. Same, yeah. Same yeah. So we we were just about to leave and pay, and someone actually paid for our meal for us. I was like, no, 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 don't do that. But they insisted, and that's wow. That's so lovely. Okay, guys, that was really good. Like really good. Like Indian cuisine, all of that roti. It's, it's honestly one of my favorite foods, but I've. I don't know if I've had it that nice before, like ever. <laughs> I don't know how we're gonna top that. I don't know how the roti banjir is gonna go because that was absolutely delicious. I would have that again. I have that for breakfast. 
off camera, come down and have it a normal morning. Curry for breakfast is a weird thought for me. I think for us in the West, like curry for breakfast is a weird thing, but I really liked it. It tasted really good for breakfast. So that guy paid for our meal and I didn't want to accept it. I said no, and he just would not, he would, ins he insisted. So he already, paid. he already paid it, he'd already done it. So, and we're gonna pay him back and he just wouldn't take our money. That was so lovely. I can't believe that, I can't believe that happened. Malaysian hospitality is, has been so good. So now though, I'm going to introduce you to my best friends so far in Malaysia. Good, can I have my two iced lattes? So I've been coming to this coffee shop every morning and he remembered my order after my first visit. Did you know that? He knew it the next day. And then when you came in, Michael came in to get me coffee a couple of times. He was like, the next time he saw me, he was like, oh, your, your boyfriend came in to get coffee. Like, that is the local coffee experience if I've ever seen it before. So I like it here and I like it better than the expensive coffee over the road. So good coffee. Tomorrow's our last day. Oh, the last day. What is yeah. your YouTube channel? I subscribe you. Oh, thank you. I've got, cause I went to the, the Philippines. I've got a few people who uh, watch me from, who are in the Philippines. Where did you say that you were from? Do you say you're from? Uh, Philippines. Tagosaan uh, Tagalog. Oh, Tagalog. Thank you for the coffee. Thanks for always coming. No, thank you for, thank you. Good coffee, I like it. Okay, so this is my normal morning routine. I come and get a coffee from him, and then I go and I get a couple of roti boys, usually quite a few. <laughs> I went there once and I literally haven't stopped going. I get a roti boy every morning. Let me know what your favorite flavor of roti boy is in the comments below if you've had it before. If you know, you know. We're gonna get a few less today because we've just had a couple of rotis downstairs. But let's head up to see the girls in Roti Boy and then we'll head to the next location. Let's go. Salamat Puggy. Hi, good morning. Could I have two buttermilk boys? Thank, Thank you. Terima kasih. <laughs> so Michael loves his buttermilk boy and I love, I loved the cheese boy. Now I've kind of moved to just the Roti Boy. So tell me which one you like in the comments below. So if you're looking for roti in KL, there is a few places you can go, but this one is one of the most popular ones. We are here at Mansion Tea Stall, and they are famous for a few things. One of them is their tea ding dong, and one of them is their roti special, also known as roti flood, where everything's all mushed together in one with a soup of aroma and flavor all together. And they have Milo! Can I have, yes, one, one please. Thank you, thank you so much for your help. So she's got a piece of roti bread out of this bucket and oh wow okay there's so much sauce on this out of the bucket and she's cut it up with this big cleaver and now it's now it's oh 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 now the egg's being cut or broken over the top not that one though <laughs> new one <laughs> awesome thank you oh this looks so good so this one is pre-cut for you she had the bit of roti and she took it out cut it up so it's all in like sort of slices and then it's put on this plate in like a mound and all around it is the sauce so a brown sauce the sambal two eggs cracked on top all as this big like soup kind of thing <laughs> a big roti soup big bread soup all right i'm really excited to try this my mouth is watering and i really want my tea tarik so warm it smells so good all right okay let's get into it all right i have the bit of roti with dipped in absolutely everything besides the sand bowl because it's a bit spicy it's still a bit spicy <laughs> it's, it's quite spicy for me to be completely honest with you um but it's got like a really nice taste it's almost peanutty, but not. I'm not sure how to describe it, but the bread is all like sliced up in different bits and it's easy to sort of grab the bits that you do need. There's a lot of flavors sort of in one place and they're all like quite strong. So I guess the difference between the two would be that the other one is separated, right? So you can pick what sauce or dip that you want. This one is all mixed and mushed together in one spot, but this is really good. I'm gonna eat it all. <laughs> This is actually my first tea tarik, I'm pretty sure. So, the way he like slung it up in there, that was the coolest thing. I love that. All right, let's try it. This one's really hot. I, for some reason, thought it was cold. Like I touched it and it was hot and I was confused, but obviously tea is normally hot. Unless it's iced tea. Anyway. <laughs> it's so nice. It's so like fluffy. 
is like a word I kind of describe it, like fluffy. Spiciness sort of taste or flavor to it. I don't know how to describe it, but it's very sweet and very fluffy and smooth. I would say smooth. I think the way that they cut it, <laughs> I think that's what makes it the smooth like texture that it is. But it's very like, I just keep thinking fluffy. Honestly, this is, I'd, I'd built this up for years and years and years. This is better than I thought it would be. This is so good. What was that? That wasn't leave me alone, I'm eating roti face. <laughs> All right, this is Michael's first hot tea tarik, which is very strange Ooh. because he's come here to Kuala Lumpur in Malaysia like five times. I always get last teas. The same as you, I always get last teas, right? It is so nice. So was it worth waiting five times to get to Kuala Lumpur for, <laughs> for the tea tarik? No, I wish I had it earlier. I wish <laughs> I ate it much earlier. I've wasted five years of my life. I'm gonna bother them for some Nestle. Hi. Can I get another, can I get Neslo? Please, just one. Yum. You're gonna make it? <laughs> oh, that looks so good. He's like getting the Milo. Oh, I love Milo so much. I know Milo comes from Australia, which is where I'm from, but I like it even better in Malaysia. Neslo is. Oh, yum. I think that, oh, maybe that's the Milo. I don't know, one of them is Milo. And he's put the hot water in. I'm sorry, always oh, got sweet stuff too. Ah, oh. Whoa. Oh, you're talented. I was tall. And then ice. Oh, I'm so excited. Delicious. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much. I don't know if you know this, but I absolutely am obsessed with Milo. I told you my first video. I'm telling you again now, I love Milo. So I've taken a, was it Nestlo? And I've got a mix of Nescafe coffee, because I also love coffee. So it's really just two of my favorite things in one. And we've done a Nestlo, which is both of them together. I've got an iced one. I love this. Oh, it's just so good. I. I like it more than the tea, Tarek. I'm sorry. Tell me in the comments below, are you team Tarek or are you team Neslo? Which is coffee and Milo. I'm team Neslo, I'm sorry. Yum. I love this, this is my favorite. Okay, so I was talking to him and he said the roti boom was really good. So we're going, ow, oh, ooh, it's warm. <laughs> so I said, yes. I was like, do we have room for more roti? And I was like, I always have room for more roti. So we're gonna try this one. What he did was like laid it out and then he put like the sweet, like I think it was sugar and it looked like like butter and then it like puffed up on the pan. Oh, it's like fluffy. All right, let's try this one. Very nice. Very nice, yeah. Oh, no more though, I'm full. You fed me too much food. <laughs> Um, next time. <laughs> so we're gonna try this one. We've got all this like stuff coming out of it. I think it's butter, sugar, I'm not sure, but it looks really good. That's so good. So that's really sweet. It's crispy on the outside and soft on the inside. Mm, I love roti. Yum. That was roti two ways plus roti boom, which is a little added bonus extra. I am full of bread, that's for sure. Now, what kind of roti did I like? Which one was my favorite? All roti. <laughs> I like all of the bread. I do think I like the uh, plain ones better, the sweet ones even, but I like all roti. Which one's your favorite? What kind of roti do you like? What else should I try here in Malaysia? The Nescafe Milo was amazing and the tea tarik. It was my first one of them today as well. If you like this video, I know you're gonna like one of the ones on the screen right now. So click on this one, if not on this one and watch that one after you're done here. If you like my video, make sure you do like and subscribe. That really helps me out in my channel and I'll see you in the next video in Malaysia. Bye.